A sea palace. Looks like Eggman's robots are here too. I'm ready to take them out. Good to know, Knuckles. Good to know. All right, so sea palace. Uh, Ocean Palace. Why did I call it Sea Palace? I like Ocean Palace a lot more than Seaside Hill. One thing about Seaside Hill is it pretty much became the de facto um, Green Hill Zone. Because this was supposed to be a return to the classics. Hence why Eggman's ship is all enveloping. Got it. Right, so she, these... Whoop. Listen to all that grammatical inconsistency. Right, so, uh, now, you might be wondering about Tails' voice actor, as I cycle through characters like that, uh, this is probably doing that part of the playthrough, ladies and gentlemen. Um, Tails' voice actor changed. Ryan Drummings is still doing something, and you might be wondering, why did they change Tails' voice actor? This was back when Sega still used to use child voice actors for uh, doing their characters, the young ones, in this case, Tails. And the thing about child voice actors, they don't stay young forever. Uh, pretty much, I think it wasn't until uh, the four kids cast that uh, Sega actually started using... Um, what is it called? They started actually using uh, adult females to do the children's voice to do tales of voice. Well, really, children. Okay, general. Because generally speaking, uh, that's what a lot of um, adult uh, female actresses do. They'll do, like, younger kids, younger boys, because they can get to the pitch for them, and they can keep consistent. For example, Kate Higgins is the current uh, the current voice actor of Tales, but I have to say, she does a really good job. Probably the best Tales. Alright, now for the triangle jump. Pretty much jump in the air, hit the wall, and then just tap the A button, and you will do the triangle jump. Something... I actually like it, and they brought it back in Shadow of the Hedgehog and all things. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, that looked like I was just gonna careen right off into the edge. Wow. Ugh. Right, so... No, right. I think that's a level up. That's why I want to get that. Because remember, level ups are good. Nah, that's just right. Every hundred rings, you'll get a life standard Sonic Fair. There's the level up. Standard Sonic Fair. Uh, we're gonna go over this way real quick. Because I have life. And, right, so here's the speed gates. I'm going to switch back to Knuckles, because I believe, if I'm remembering you correctly, no, I'm switching right here. Why bother? Right? And we got Sleeping Egg Pond, because Eggman programmed his elite guard to sleep. Way to fucking go. IQ of... Hit the rocks, Knuckles. Shit to those rocks. I always told him he should go and get those. Check that. Oh, perfect. I needed that shield. Shields will save your butt. Right, so we have different paths to go to. Um, now, I'm going to be going with the speed path on this one because I don't have to hit the A button each time when I'm doing that. Uh, the annoying thing about power characters, for some odd reason, we should Sega programmed it that for power characters, you have to pretty much. Um, Shoot it, each of the people out. Okay, that, that's spawning. Needed that. Nope, nope. Don't want to. Don't want to spin. What am I doing? I could just. I, well, that's how you're supposed to disarm the robots if you don't have enough of um, Sonic's level. Enough of Sonic's level to be able to do it. Whoop. Because otherwise, if you do have a level 3, then you can just simply homing attack into them and it'll get rid of their shield. Because, like I said, we can generate wind when we are level 3. I feel more comfortable when I have for tails when I'm flying. Uh, please note that the uh, ability to fly is very limited, so you gotta watch out. Thundershoot, broken. Um, so, for tails, as you can see, his air meter that's right below him is not going down because I am staying in place. You can infinitely fly in place as long as... Oh, there goes my ring. And there goes my key. Um, you can infinitely fly as long as you don't move. If you move, then Tails' uh, meter will go down. Right. I think that might be. Yeah, that will make that. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just going to do that. Uh, there's luckily a key nearby, so uh, we're not too bad. 
At least this stage is a lot shorter than the goddamn one we had before. Let's go! Three. Thunder shoot! And watch as it takes care of all these egg flappers. These are called egg flappers, by the way. Uh, they pretty much want to stay around. Tails level up. And let's go up here, and there should be a key around here. I might have jumped. Yes, I did. He is down here. Let's go. Key is around here somewhere. I need the key to get the special stage because the reason why I skipped the special stage in the first uh, in the first act is because in the first act you will not get a chaos emerald. Only in the second act will you ever get chaos emeralds when you are doing special stages. It is the same special stage if you were to do it in Act One, but the thing is you have. to that's pretty much just practice. Yeah, see, I passed the key. I'm gonna cut till I get it. It should be down here. I want that chaos temple. So let's see. It should be down here. I think. I it was. Maybe I was wrong. Maybe there wasn't a key. Maybe I'm just a dirty, dirty liar. Oh well. Anyway, let's go up. Now you can see the problem, though, of basically, you know, when you get hit and you lose the key, you pretty much get screwed. Uh, right, go up. Uh, right. Or maybe it was because I wasn't at the area where the goddamn key was yet. Uh, he's on the other side over here. You can see it right over there. Uh, the key, the crates that the keys are in are only breakable by power characters, so keep that in mind. And uh, to disengage from the uh, triangle jump, I guess. Pretty much you can easily just, um, what is it called? Just hit the B button and you'll go down. Alright, so, I should have done Knuckles again, but, run! Whoa, what's with that giant rock? I don't know! Yep, there it is with its rubber band AI. It's got terrible rubber band AI, actually. Uh, in the... Uh, Scarlet Equinox run of this. I know I lost the key, unfortunately, so I can't show off the special stage. Um, in the Scarlet Equinox run, this thing has terrible, terrible rubber band AI. To where you could actually get hit with it while you're in the air during that first part. That's how we lost the key multiple times, and unfortunately it's how I lost the key in this one. I wanted to show